Alright y'all, I wasn't planning on doing this video. <laughs> I was literally about to do my gunner reaction. I was about to roll up, I just got my smoothie. And then I seen they gave, they gave Ja Moran his uh, suspension. So I'm gonna give my initial reactions. 25 games is not that bad. I honestly don't think that's that bad. I thought they were cut up. Smoke, boy, I thought they was gonna smoke that nigga, boy. What, I thought they was finna 50. I was damn near gonna make a video on predictions, but. <laughs> I'm like, nah, that would be crazy. I don't I don't appreciate all of these old people trying to deride the John Moran situation and all these random people. And, and nigga, Steven Jackson, we don't give a fuck what you think about, you know what I mean? But anyways, that's besides the point. <laughs> but I thought they was going to smoke him. I thought they was going to smoke him. I thought they was going to give him 50 games. 25 games is not that bad. He going to stay on the Grizzlies. The Grizzlies are not going to get rid of him. And that shouldn't affect their record too much. They should still be able to make the playoffs. They should still be able to make the playoffs. So 25 games honestly isn't too bad. But John Moran, you got to make sure this is your last. And, I, and I'm not going to do a whole lot of preaching. But you got to make sure this is your last time, nigga. Because, nigga, <laughs> you just got to make sure this is your last time. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but yeah, I would have thought they would have given a little bit more than 25. If I would have had to make a prediction, I would have predicted a little bit more than 25. So I'm honestly not mad at 25. I'm not mad at 25. I'm not mad at 25. 25 not too bad. At the same time, he didn't really do anything, but yeah, 25 is not too bad. Oh shit, John Moran dropped the statement. I have had time to reflect and I realize how much hurt I've caused. I want to apologize to the NBA and Grizzlies, my teammates in the city of Memphis. I, Adam Silver, gave me a, me, I'm sorry for the harm I've done to the kids who look up to me. Right, he didn't write any of this to him. My sponsors, I'm going to be a better representation. Yeah, so don't drop me, Nike, please. <laughs> Continuing to work on my mental health, I'm going to be training so that I, yeah. Um. <laughs> yeah, he didn't write any of this. He didn't write any of this. They made him say all of this. I'm not mad at it, though. I'm not mad at it. <laughs> it shouldn't even really affect, if, uh, affect his brand deals. Like, Nike shouldn't get rid of him. All he has to do is make sure he doesn't fuck up again for at least some a few years. He just got to keep everything offline, nigga. He shouldn't even, nigga, fuck, don't even post on Instagram, bro. Get an Instagram handler. Have somebody post for you, like, you know what I'm saying? Just stay away from the damn phone because you don't want to look back and be 40-something like, damn, I wish I had that 50, 60, whatever million dollars I lost. So, you know what I mean? Like, just, just shut up. <laughs> just shut up and collect the check. People try and say that uh, free speech and all of this don't exist. I mean, people try to say that free speech exists. Boy, that shit do not exist. Do not let them niggas for ain't no such things. What? <laughs> for nobody, boy. What? That shit is a cap. <laughs> That's one of the biggest American lies. Free speech. <laughs> I'm dead. Anyways, <laughs> I'm out.